Hey there friend and welcome to day 70. So we're about to bring this whole thing home. So this, the last seven days, including today, have been themed around this idea of purpose, right? And you should know it by now. What is purpose? Purpose is largely this idea, this desire that we want to contribute to the well-being of others, that we want to serve, that we want to do good. I think that most people go through life looking for an opportunity to matter. And what better way to matter than to watch how you matter to someone else. When you serve another and they reciprocate with a thank you or just simply a glance or even just a feeling that is a non-verbal feeling that you can sense from them, you feel something. And it drives you to want to do more because you realize you're not pointless. You matter. Today I want you to know that you matter. And today I want you to know that it doesn't matter how big or small your contribution, your positive contribution to others in the society. If you are positively contributing to others, you are living a piece of your purpose. You know, there's a phrase that I like that says something along the lines of, men are that they might have joy. And it's not just men, it's women, right? This is from a passage of scripture. And you are that you might have joy. And there is virtually no greater way to go and find joy than to live through purpose by serving others. I promise you that if you don't know what it is you want to do in this life, if all these results, you've created 70 days worth of positive results at this point. Think about that. 70 consecutive days of positive results. You are achieving something absolutely magnificent. Congratulations. And what I hope you're proving to yourself and you're proving to the world is that you have the ability to positively contribute to others, which positively contributes to your life, which drives and fuels your ability not to just strive for a goal, but to achieve a result daily and regularly that allows you to truly do something that matters on a daily and consistent basis. So what is your purpose? Why are you here on this earth? Well, I'll tell you, you're here to have joy. You're here to find happiness. You're here to find something that can fuel you and drive you to do more good. Imagine if everybody woke up every single day and they have this thought, today I'm going to do good. Today I'm going to serve. Imagine if we woke up and the first thought on our mind is going to be, today I will selflessly serve at least one person one time. What would the world look like? What type of results would you achieve in your life? If every day, by serving others and contributing positively, it fueled you and it made you feel awesome, would you create better results or worse results if you felt awesome every day? Would you have more depression or less depression? Or virtually no depression at all, no sadness at all, if you chose to look for opportunities to serve and give back and do amazing things on a regular basis? Think about that. What would the world look like? What would your world look like? So as we conclude this week, here's the result for today. I want you to go to your journal and I want you to make a list of five positive results that you created this week. Now I'm not just talking about the results that we've done in these daily videos. I mean just go through and find five things that you can consider positive that are a result of what you've done this week. Okay? Think through what are five positive results that you've created this week. And I want you to think about how those results connected either directly or indirectly to the selfless service that you gave. Then I want you to analyze those results and write a statement of what you think your purpose in this life might be. As we conclude these seven days, I hope that if nothing else, you have seen what life can feel like if you go and do good for other people. And I hope that you've helped it that you've been able to help yourself find some more purpose than you had. Finding purpose can take some time, but I promise you, if you will continue to selflessly serve at least one person once a day for the rest of your life, your purpose will come through loud and clear. And when you combine that with those things that you're passionate about, not the stuff you don't like, but the stuff that you're passionate about, it will give you the fuel to just keep going, which is what will allow you, through that consistency and persistency, to achieve whatever the result may be that is your big life result that you're hoping to achieve. And in the meantime, you'll be achieving a bunch of small ones along the way.
Was this week good? I hope so. I hope it was positive. Next week, we're going to also do some incredible things. So we'll see you on day 71.